tolls are here to stay to at least the end of 2019, but with provisions in place to 2021. We're on the N3 in South Africa, which is like a big highway uh, that connects Johannesburg, which is the main city, to like other big cities. For many motorists, the e-toll gantry only represents a monitoring system to collect e-tolls. And this bridge here is where they have special things for, uh, they track you, you pay tolls to use this road through these lights. You also get half blinded when you <laughs> go through them. But in reality, there is more behind the system. With a small dedicated group of professionals, well resourced, protecting and serving eToll road users day and night. The only question that remains is how low a tariff is acceptable going forward. We speak to road users to find out how much they're prepared to pay. Uh, not a bloody cent. There are no benefits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, because what's the, you know, we, my taxes go towards the, the, the roads for my salary. Um, there's fuel taxes. So I'm happy with all that when my taxes go. But now I must pay more on that. So where's our money actually going, people? I won't pay at all. How come? Because of the corruption in the country. No, not willing to pay at all. How come? It's, we're already paying exorbitant taxes on fuel. No need to, there's no benefit for the for road users at all. No, man, it's, it's obvious then. Uh, those roads have been built like for a long years then. For now, then for them to, to say we must pay something then, which means that one is not good. Actually, they, they're robbing the people that are using the road. I'm Bryce Nicholson and you're watching Joburg Today.